Hello. Welcome to D&D. It's time for the final episode of Chains of the Abyss. Wow. I am currently calculating the price. Wow. Okay, we're fine. Okay, I have everything set. Never mind. All right. So, uh, we can start right up as I click on change. Whoa, look, it's them. It's, it's them. Whoa. I definitely. Hello, I'm streaming. Oops. Well, Aegis has okay. internet Hello? issues. Oh, no. Fuck. Um, uh, they oh, died. no. Episode 56. Oh, oh no. no, what a shame. Ah. I wish Toto was here. <laughs> <laughs> I run to fucking the Philippines to grab Aedis. <laughs> you bring this man over stateside. Yeah, hey, this just so uh, just goes, uh, boy, why are you here? Like a player made a wish. <laughs> <laughs> mm. All right, a warrior always keeps true. Uh. Okay, but uh, yes, uh, I can start up with uh, Lynn's thingy, uh, as it's time for battle. I can't play Elder Ring music because it's too early for spoilers as well. So instead, uh. Let's see. I've never actually played Elden Ring. Well, there's a song that I want to play, but it's a spoiler for, like, the final boss itself, so. Uh, I never feel mind. like you should play it. Re I feel like you should play it regardless because it's fucking music. Like, we talking oh, no, base game or we talking I know it's more like DLC? LP. One of the you greatest. Know, uh, you know, if you just didn't time. mention that it was a spoiler for that boss, you could have just played it and no one would have known. No, no, no. <laughs> the, the video literally shows like the boss at the front, his arms stretched there's, out wide. There's, you know, there's there's <laughs> more than one person posting them, and I know of one of them that's only posting them with the like, <laughs> mate, like the the character that they did like for the DLCs like cover. Uh. Ah. Mm -hmm. uh should I I... Well, it? anyhow, it is better now. <laughs> Whoa. All right, it's fine. I got this one. All right. Yeah, mm -hmm. and I'll just stick on a video game playlist or something afterwards. All right. Uh, Lynn, that's basically what you see is that uh, uh, Toto has managed to pull out what seems to be some weird creature as uh, the Dreadhound's body seems to be somewhat crumbling and weak. However... It seems to somewhat still be there, well, stable, as it simply looks towards you all, and it seems to become enraged. Hmm? This creature is now enraged. What the Wham. Time? Baby mode activated, guys. Baby mode's active. Yes. Oh. Alright, uh, Lynn's turn? Oh. Wait. Yes. Where's the One code? Dice counter's been done. Oh, uh, Isn't looked and pinned. In spoiler, End of I believe. Spoiler channel. It's now a permanent link. Oh. Whoa. Yes. Wait, for all games? Yes. Yeah. Oh my god, congrats on the upgrade. Oh wow. <laughs> I know what I'm spending ten dollars a month on Ingrock anymore. You have to. So, uh, right. I can't remember. Did I? Did I mark the Dreadhound? Yes. Okay. Cool. And then I have my bonus action. God, what the fuck does Rippy buy on stages? Well, uh, 
Oh, right. No. Let's uh, let's not forget that skill checks are a thing, and I can do them, and they sometimes matter. Well. Hey. Yes. Looking down on our notes to see if we actually even have anything left. Oh, yes. Love's Enraged. Gun. No, just do enraged. Oh, wait, no, that's gone. Never mind. Yeah. Is, what, what is the enrage doing? <laughs> All right. So, it's simply known as... Uh, you've brought it down to a certain HP threshold, so it has uh, the ability known as uh, Enraged Enrage. <clears throat> uh, okay. Yes. Yeah. Uh, <clears throat> upon doing so, it becomes enraged at the cost of its own life force. Uh, this creature uh, will now have a minus 10 to its constitution. Uh, but at the cost is that it gains temporary hit points and advantage on all attack rolls uh, at the start of its turn. Oh. However, you two have advantage against it. Okay. <laughs> yes. Well, I'm the, I'm the punch it because that's all I can do with my turn. Lynn, mainly. fucking credit. I beg of it's you. Time. It's time. No, it's not time. <laughs> oh it's my god. Five, six, six. Five, six, six. Five, six, six. <laughs> Hello? Miss. It's, 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 did I just miss <laughs> my elven egg attack? No. Yeah, you did. Please roll again and please uh, God almighty. No. <laughs> Nine, nice. two. <laughs> Bro, please, what? <laughs> Holy shit! Six, seven, eight. Here, here. No, I have to do the funny. By the way, the funny. I want Hold you on. to. I want you to know that it has been seven rounds. Oh, come and on! And I have tacked five out of the seven rounds. And with Elvenac, I should have crit at least three times <laughs> by the the end of this turn. And I've Yummy. yet to the entire combat. Okay, Boy, bonus I... action. I do a uh, Pam <laughs> bop. If I don't crit on the attack roll, I crit on the one one hundred. I rolled a fucking one. I rolled a fucking one. <laughs> <laughs> this is really is a really good old time. Yes. God damn. <laughs> <laughs> Lynn, as you take your lance and basically slash towards it three times, yeah, the first attack, somehow the creature manages to basically slash it away with its needle. The second attack comes in as it literally headbutts your lance, somehow taking nothing at all. As the third one goes in, the needle then, of course, slams that one away for whatever reason. You're throwing. Oh, fuck. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Okay, now, now I, I have my redemption arc right now as I smack <laughs> it with Pam <laughs> for my bonus action. I do oh, not have my. I, I did hit once. You rolled yeah. a 13. Is that crit? <laughs> no. Hear me out, boy. No. <laughs> Listen, I called. I called, you know, Vavel. It should matter, right? Wow. I mean, wow. Like, <laughs> Well, <laughs> I'm so okay, because of that void, I'm adding a smite to it. Fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's it. For my turn. <laughs> I... Actually, uh, Bluey's got a got a little funny little little uh, bite. I forgot the advantage. One second. <sighs> Um, so actually, Smite is now a bonus action. <laughs> okay, <laughs> fine. It's not, no it's way. not. Hey, no way, he just did it. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Alright, 26, uh, Yep. And Bluey got a... That should be a 29 <laughs> to hit for 15 hit. piercing. And a... Bonk with the cold breath. Radiant breath. Even though it says cold breath, I need to edit that yeah. finally. Ew. Dodge. Oh my fuck. You suck. I'm I love you, but you suck. <laughs> oh, holy shit. 
Okay. Um. All right. Yes. And suddenly, as you release your breath weapon, the Dreadhound just simply flies up. You bitch. <laughs> How dare you fly? You oh, asshole wait. rat bastard. Hey, I got a fucking AOP on you, bitch. Come here. <laughs> Thematic. Hey, boy. <laughs> what, does it. What you. <laughs> what does it do? Does it fly up or does it just stay there? It dodges a breath weapon. Okay. Okay. Natural one on your Ashana. I'm writing it down. The Dreadhound <laughs> seems kind of freaky. Uh, now, what if instead of the Dreadhound, it was actually the Freaky Hound, and instead of the Abyss, it was the Shut up, 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 shut up. Okay, oh. I'm just gonna do my usual. I believe I have Quantum Gaze up, so. And I think I have enough spell slots. Yeah. So, Ungabunga, me cast Hex. And... Fuck. Cast Hex on Dreadhound, and... Let's do the man. Eldritch Blast. Black, black, black. Holy shit, did I crit? Hey! Yeah. Mm hmm <laughs> 20. Okay, and each... Uh, how many of them hit? I think all, all of them. them. You rolled a 40, way, 38, 33, and 37. Oh, damn. By the cool. way, the rolls so the let me do the... 21, 20. <laughs> okay, let me just quickly do the math real quick. I believe Hex is a D6, right? Yes. yes. So 46 plus... Holy fuck. 88? 88? Was that right? Um, can I someone believe it's? I believe it's a D eight with um the quantum gaze. Which you want hex oh. or not hex? Why I call you hex? Oak. Oh. Huh? Forty nine. Okay, so that should be the damage. Of... I was just wondering if somebody could snap me back to the map. You know, you could just scroll out and it's on the map. Oh, dude! Yeah, and I'll what burn the, the system. No, as I've been well. scrolling out for like thirty minutes. It's, it's, it's like to the north. Minutes. Oh, it is. Uh, scroll the notes in ja uh, Chain's channel oh, is the okay. updated one, right? Yeah. Okay. Probably. All right. What do we want to remove, guys? Yeah. It's health bar. God, I wish. Unless that's possible. Um. I don't think Beast Mother will be an issue. Uh, uh, remove enraged and rage. Actually, no. Leave that. That's good for us. Hmm. I'm. Oh, hmm. fucking smite the weak. Smite the weak? I think so. Because it does a fuck ton of damage. Oh, or yeah. Or Titan's no. Tears. Or Titan's Tears. Critically hit, reaction con save, or have your max hit points reduced by half. Yeah, no, get rid of that. Yeah, That's I was about to say, what are the odds that they're going to crit us? But let's not fuck it's with fine. that. Let's Every remove Titan's Tears. All right. As you, uh, as you remove it, you will suddenly see that the burning around its body is suddenly... Its titan ability is gone. No. Hmm. Oh, uh, Void, is the damage done accounting <clears throat> for the true, da like, true force damage from, uh, the... the fuck is it? Quantum Gaze? No. Ah. Well... Uh, Oh, fuck, right, okay, and I also have my clones and shit. Right, cool. Uh, same, same story, thing. pretty much. Yep. Boop. Hex. Yeah, 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 yeah. Hex and Eldritch Blast. Uh, boop, 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 boop. Uh, minus two for each of those, I believe. So, I believe three of them Those should hit, misses. if it's AC is 25? Yes. Okay. And Hex should be 3d6. Twelve damage, cool. And I have my vine blades too, cool. All right. What okay, movement do they have? Let me check. Oh. Movement, 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 movement. Ten. 
Fuck me, they're slow. Jesus. All right, and the Vine Blights will just move up like 10 feet. Fucking summoners is what you get. <laughs> to be fair, this is like, what, the second time I've ever been able to use the Vine Blights? Ever? Start of my turn, I heal 60. Fuck. Oh, I'm going to make an Arcana. Because I'm going to start doing dumb shit. 16. Okay. Uh, I do this to the mother of all. What's she planning on doing? Well, she's gonna blow up. What the fuck do you mean, blow me? up? Gonna blow up. Okay. And act well, like she don't know nobody? Well, guess what I do? I pull out Vera's needle that she gave me. I'm gonna fucking run up and uh, stab the mother of all with it. Oh. That'd be an attack room. Mm -hmm. I have ad Surely you roll an at one on the D100 again. Advantage because of a fucking okay. Titan thing. 29. That's a hit. Whoa. Wonderful. You stab it with the needle. Ow. One second. All right. As you suddenly run the water, take out the needle and basically just jab her in the side of the fucking neck. <laughs> as yeah. uh, she just looks at you ooh, as you're approaching and just goes, Ooh, what are you do? Oh god, what the hell is that? As you basically just stab her. <laughs> uh, you'll suddenly see as the, uh, as the black liquid within basically goes through her veins, even somewhat of a black sort of trail. And then she goes, No, no, no. 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 As, uh, you see that she implodes into black dust. Uh. You wanna oh. look up? Looks up again? As you look up, you see a giant birdcage leaving. Oh, what? fuck no. Uh, I fly up after it. <laughs> it's 100 Actually. Up. That's fine. I have an infinite range dagger. I'm knocking it down. I have more attacks. Wow. Alright. We can attack then. Alright. Bam. Bye. Alright. As you throw the dagger up, you suddenly see as it collides with the force cage. It sort of tinks off, then returns back to your hand. And I guess what? Two more attacks. What? Alright. You hit against the force cage. Uh, can I Titan's Flame it to burn away the cage? No. Well, I'm still hitting it again. Alright. I'm mm -hmm. looking for a crit. <clears throat> Alright, no crit. So am I, buddy. So am yeah. I. <laughs> Whoa. I've been That's looking your... for them for days. <laughs> I'm sorry, That's... dog. <laughs> Despite your attempts, you are unable to break it, as it just simply tinks against the uh, cage itself. It's not going through the cage? No. It's the end. Why is it not going through the cage? Good question. Bro, you didn't say the line. You gotta say the line. <laughs> I ain't crit, so blow me. <laughs> Can I make a reaction to also use temporal ship on that then? No. Nah. Fortunate. Uh. I guess I'm just gonna keep flying at it. How far up is it? And it's currently 120 feet. Okay. Uh. Wait, Scylla, didn't you put haste on me? Or no? They did not. Okay, I'm just trying, trying to remember. I looked through my items. Mm. 
Bully. Okay, I'm flying up. After I... it. Beep, uh, I... Yeah. I have 30 feet up. That's my turn. A Dreadhound can make an AOP, but I won't deal damage because it's a pussy. Well, sure, I can make an AOP. Uh, I'm gonna bite you, Lamau. Okay, okay. Oh, you're right. Uh, is, is that all right here? Uh, holy shit, I just realized uh, that the macro from uh, the Dreadhound, its crits have actually been less than what it should be. Holy shit. <laughs> it hasn't been feel it's been in, it's been dealing to the eight on crits. <laughs> Lamau. Ah, uh, well, oopsie daisy. Let me just fix that. <laughs> All right, yo. There we go. I make my attack! Yar! Ah, oh, fuck, I yeah, rolled one. No, oh, two. Oh, nice wait, attack, I'm, dog. I have advantage. Fuck. Fuck! <laughs> Maybe. <Does> not matter. <laughs> <laughs> nice. And negative damage? The fuck is negative damage? Good question. Stupid ass Shabingus damage. All right, Dreadhound's turn, Pog. <clears throat> uh, well, it looks down at all of you. It looks up at the cage. It's gonna try and fly towards the cage. <laughs> Lobao, as uh, in the Aeopus. Aedas, you've reached all that thing, right? Oh, wait. Do I have range yeah. because my... Yeah, my you, you're, right next, you're right next to it. You're right next to it. Okay. You want me to uh, roll for you, Aedas? Or are you good? I can, I can roll this. Yup. Also, you have uh, elven, ac <laughs> elven accuracy. Oh. Uh, yeah. Because you have advantage already. There you oh. go, you crit. Hey, yo. <laughs> I'm not bad. Wait a moment. <laughs> I'm so sorry, Lynn. I'm so sorry. God, God fuck out. What did I say last What did I say? Yeah. What did I say? Bring your ass here, boy. Fucking. Okay. Uh, and what do we. Could I. Could I burn whatever's the, the cages since it's the dried out and still connected? I'm not part of it. This is uh this is Vivi's thingy that uh that man did. Oh okay. Um I guess let's see what do we remove? Uh let's smite of the week, I guess. You're doing smite the week? Yeah. Or did we remove the one that removes our t our, our uh hit points? A lot all right, of them yeah. removes um, all the ones in Mother Solario remove our hit, uh, hit die. Okay. Smite okay. the weak. Smite the weak makes us lose a lot more. Okay then. I'll remove smite the weak, and then add some a bit of flame to that. Burr, 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 burr. Uh, I guess I gotta smite. stop the void twenty <laughs> Yeah, void. Can you uh? Hey, I roll a fucking one on my D100. I dies. 26 true damage. <laughs> well, it's double because you crit. <clears throat> uh, how many dice did you roll? Five. Okay, then it's another additional 5d10. Uh, so here you go. <clears throat> Stop. Holy shit. Fuck you, Void. You should not be mm -hmm. rolling dice for us. Fuck you. <laughs> what do you mean? <laughs> I love rolling 18 on a 5d10. I hate you. <clears throat> Alright, that, that damage. 44. 
44 and 44 to myself. <laughs> you only take 26, I think. Okay. <laughs> okay then. And okay, he stays there. Uh <laughs> Mm -hmm. It is not my turn. Alright, well, <clears throat> you'll see that the Dreadhound will basically fly up to the cage uh, if you also want to make an A of Deadman. Didn't Toto just Sentinel it? Oh, wait, Sentinel has. Ugh, Toto has Sentinel? Alright. Yeah. Yeah, zero. <clears throat> Damn. Zero. Okay, I guess I don't fly away. Um... He looks it. <laughs> No 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 Thirty this is thirty years boy you had this hole coming to you okay. great joy, thirty look, fucking years the great jaw will look down towards you all then as it will open its gaping jaw as you basically see what seems to be a violet breath Gah. Violet Wow Violet Let's see Purple, violet, uh, cool, I can hit you. <laughs> Purple. Oh my god, I hit everyone but Louie. <laughs> what the fuck? You don't hit the vine blight. <laughs> the singular vine blight. Well, it's a what 90 is, feet cone, you... you're actually right, hang on. Yeah, I, I do hit the vine blight, thank you, Rogi. I was talking about the one on the right. You should hit the one on the right. Yeah. Damn. Alright, everyone, make a deck save. Not ah, me. Okay. Not me. Thank God. Ooh. Danger sense. Danger sense. <laughs> Oof. Uh, is this magic or. Uh, it is magical, yes. Okay. Not a spell. I believe I still have just advantage on magical yeah. effects in general. Yeah, all of the magical effects. Okay, that's good. Can't say the same about my echo though. Oh, cool. What the fuck is that? Vine Blights? Oh, <clears throat> this man's still cooked. Bah. DC 30. Oh. Uh, that Vine Blight's so fucking cooked. <laughs> Toto didn't make it with a 19. That's fucked up. Yeah. <laughs> oh, wait. Uh, aha, no Pally Aura. Uh, I went bye bye. Yeah. Um, he's right next You're to me. Oh yeah, you have Pally Aura, so the add... Yeah, the Paragon of Nature. Oh, so he does make it, because I think your charisma is more than six. Yeah. So Toto does make it. Good for him. Oh! <laughs> Did the spells make it? Ooh. 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 Uh, Bells uses a legendary action. She's still going to make that otherwise. What legendary the fuck? resistance. Okay, I'm not asking. She, does, she... I love you, Boothang. Oh god. I mean, may as well just roll it anyway. Yeah. Yeah, she ain't making that. <laughs> she almost oh, succeeds. <clears throat> oh, bubba. Alright. Uh, everyone made it then? Uh, Alright. As the breath fires out towards you all, all of you will take half of this. Uh, oh. So, do, 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 26. 26 damage. Cook. Do yes. I, I, I still have a potion of invulnerability? Yes. So is that half half? If uh, what? Potion of uh invulnerability. Oh yeah, you take half. So oh, but... thirteen. Take half. thirteen, Toto. You're resistant to negative damage because it specifies all damage. Yep. Alright, 
Uh, subtly, <laughs> though, for people who failed, I can show. As you basically see as the laser sort of breath fires out towards it all, you see that the vine blight begins to grow what seems to be purple roses across its body, and suddenly it just <laughs> disappears. Um... Anyway, that hey was guys, one of my attacks. This attack is going towards Dean. Oh? <laughs> oh, why? Like... Why? <laughs> Miss. No, you, it doesn't hit you. Yep. Wow. All type shit. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, you fucking dodge the attack, and suddenly it goes in for the bite, you jump on its fucking forehead and flip. <laughs> Monkey flip. Monkey. Yes. Uh, one second. Do, 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 do. And then it will make its last attack also against Dean. Bruh. I know. Try to hit me, pussy. I'm at 20 feet, Rich. Watch this crit, too. <laughs> nah. That would hit. Um, yeah, my AC is 21, so. Can I evasion? That's not evasion. You can uncanny dodge for half damage. That's 47. <laughs> Let me double check how much your boy has real quick. Um, You're at 144. You have more than that. Oh, I'm straight. Yeah, I take that shit full on. Just half it. Just half it. You're not going to get attacked again. Just half it. Okay, well, it fine. Well, it him from attacking later in the turn. Oh. Yeah. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to throw a dagger at Dean's fucking head. Please make me that DC 25 wisdom save. Ah. Uh, um. Saving throw. I pressed every button but saving throw. Fuck. Oh, I'm in auras. No, it doesn't. It's, no, mm, you're no. not in any yeah. aura. That's not, uh, that's not a pally aura for me, uh, oh. Dean. Well, That's crazy. I'm dead. <laughs> you get paralyzed. Uh, no, he gets a bardic is what he gets. Oh. That's just a one dig. Wait, no, that's... This bardic, just 1d4 on Lynn top, right? Special. 1D, it's 1d8 plus 1D8. Lynn's charisma. <laughs> oh, wait, is this uh, a magic effect, by the way? Yes. Actually, no. Oh, the, uh, the attack itself, no. Uh, but you made it. Yeah, you made it. They made it. Uh, oh, I made it. Okay. Alright. Oh, oh. Uh, Dreadhow will roar out towards the sky, towards the cage, oh, okay. as it can do nothing. As Dean, it is now your turn. Shut okay. up, you oversized bitch. Hey, talk to him, buddy. Good shit. Stinky um, bastard. Damn. Good thing he's not a bod. Um, mm. I'm probably Frank just gonna, him. yeah, I'm just gonna fucking smack the guy, right? You have advantage. Cause of all allies, honey. Whoop hell. 29. Double 13s. Double 13s on that. Ending sneak attack. Ooh. Ah, damn, 28 sneak is crazy. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> Bro, <Rope moment. clears throat> Is that 35 or yeah, 35 plus 28? Yep. Oh, wait. <laughs> I got it. God damn it. I'm sorry, I'm a little high. God damn, damn it, Oak. <laughs> I'm not high. I'm, that was a joke, but I am. Very Don't Schrodinger's douchebag your way out of it. <laughs> I am sleep deprived. Are you slip to bright. Mm. Okay. Um. Not gonna lie, boys. Huh? Oh, I guess. Do is there anything else that we can even check? Like we have everything, right? About this guy. The force cage. Hmm. Yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and do that. Uh. I'm just trying to make sure she doesn't get out of it because I think if it's. It's either investigation or arcana, right? Investigation is your better storm. Okay. Twenty-eight. 
All right, you have a minimum of 10 on your rolls. All right, what would you like to know? Um, it's whatever the fuck the force cage did. Bah. Okay. Uh, so dead man injected a funny needle into uh into the ma uh mother of all, <clears throat> Lamal, uh, causing her to of course become in a weakened state. So, uh, <clears throat> so because of being in this weakened state, uh. The force cage itself has basically managed to trap her within as a uh, <clears throat> gun. As for the origin of it, you're not really too sure since you're not really a religious or anything person. However, what I can tell you is it's that by, sometimes. The, <clears throat> by the start of round eight, the force cage will disappear. And we are on round seven. And yes. I am damn near last on the initiative. Huh. <laughs> Oh, well, I look. I Wait. honestly think that's it, boys. Basically, on once, once Toto uh, ends their turn, uh, it disappears. Okay, so we have Toto and Bells to do some damage. Except they can't do anything because even my anti fucking anything dagger couldn't get through it. <laughs> If I could get a crit in one of mine, and crit auto hits no matter what, shit. but you don't yeah. have the range for it. I do have. It's my anchor is 120, like oh. max. Okay. Yeah, fuck him up, baby. Hey, fuck him up. And hey, I, I do, up. and I have the ring of jumping and wing boots, so I can probably. You have wing boots. Yeah, it's on my inventory. In that case, prank him, John. Wait. Hey, we pranking. Get... Did I give you my wing boots? Yeah. Oh. I think we trade that. With oh, stuff. we did trade it. Right. That does right. not fuck. Please, bro. <laughs> anyway, it's Bell's turn as uh, they'll look over to the rest of you and just like point at the creature. Remember our deal. I'm going to eat that, right? Yeah, sure. Uh, oh. As long as you don't become it or become part of the abyss, I think that's fine. Heavens no. Anyway, <laughs> shove that door. Yeah. Oh. Oh, People okay. looks away. The mouth. She clicks her hand. As suddenly, what you'll see is that her somewhat like bug-like armor chitin will somewhat rumble as they fire out into what seems to be some sort of spikes. People. Mmm. Yummy. Alright. Good. One second. Okay, her attack back arrow is correct. I was just making sure. Alright. First attack. Advantage. Yeah. One. God fucking damn it. There is something wrong with her macro. It didn't have the range. <laughs> there we go. One. Ooh. There oh. we go. Fuck you. Oh, stop. <laughs> Write that down. Write that down. God damn. Write that down. First one misses. Second one hits. Uh, with that, she'll then use a companion to expend a life force of it. Uh, blah, 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 blah. All right. Companion? 6 7. 71 damage. Buh. She'll just give a thumbs up as uh, she, like, basically as a fucking bugs chitin stuff basically fires out and pierces into the side. You'll see that then she, like, she'll lick the blood on the end of it and go, Mmm, yummy. Shut up. Okay. Uh, let's see. What do I investigate? Okay, we don't have anything. I think it's just time to smack Force Cage. Okay. Okay, uh, should I click that on? Never mind. Scooby scoop. Okay, um, let's see. Give me a second. <sighs> Ring jumping. How, how long? Let's see. Just to make sure. Okay, what was that? Jump spell? <laughs> it's actually a jump spell. 
Okay. So, what's uh, 50 feet? So, 50 feet. Oh. Uh. Dude, it's time to focus the fuck up. <laughs> and my stuff is not working. I I couldn't fucking with my stuff. Uh shit. My map tools fucking crash on me. Do you want me to roll for you, bud, or do you want the honor? Uh, you go ahead. I, I'm gonna fix this. I could roll. <laughs> Fuck off. I know. <laughs> Three <All right>. attacks. <clears throat> Right. Fucking. Uh, is that with elven accuracy? Yes, it is with elven accuracy. God damn it. I do have haze, so you get and then bonus okay. action attack. Okay, so four. Okay, I'm so ass. You rolled a 19. <laughs> Best I could offer. But I think they all. Actually, it's the force cage, so none of them do any damage somehow. Yes, you managed to basically. That's basically Toto as you look up and throw your weapon into the air. You see, of course, that the fucking pickaxe will fly up, hit against the page, ah, the f fucking thing with the loud sort of boom. However, despite your onslaught of uh, attacks, it only simply ricochets against it. You hear screaming from the inside of it, and it's simple, Oh my god, why are you moving it so much? Like that from the inside. Uh, Dota fucking, Dota fucking smiles. <laughs> uh, you don't like that, don't you? Uh, you I think it's bitch. happened on the fishbowl. <laughs> Literally tapping on the fishbowl. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Uh, okay. nah, sorry, boys. Uh, that's all I can do. <laughs> How far up is the cage again? 120. Uh, 120. 120. 120. 120. But, it just, but, it, but it's popped. Yes, at the end of okay. uh, Toto's turn, as after that onslaught, you'll see that the cage will basically just simply pop away out into existence. Mm. Oh. Well. Um. Yes. So, uh, she's disappeared like 120 feet up. Is the Dreadhound still on the ground? I'm sorry, I... <laughs> yes, the Dreadhound is still there, and it's, like, crying at this point. Wee! Yeah. Baby Wee! Mine. I guess I deal with that while the people who can actually fly up or shoot her. Aww. <laughs> 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 uh. I should have read the uh, I should have read the action. Actually, I'm gonna do this in time. case I might be able to get to the... No. Okay. Well... Hmm. Yeah. It's literally one below what I needed it, because I was wanted to ask if we could figure out any information about the connect, like, what might happen if we do something to the Dreadhound before her, but... Um... Well, since I didn't get that, I guess I'll just try to learn if it has a vulnerability. I don't think we asked. We've only asked resistances. <laughs> it doesn't have any vulnerabilities, no. Yeah, that's what I thought. Uh, okay. What I will I tell you is asked, that they once it's Tim that. passed, uh, it's going to choose to blow up. <laughs> Suicide bomb. Who's got rope trick? Who's got rope trick? <laughs> But Why you know what I like can do? Like I, like, no, it's like I <laughs> Hi. Take the palm. I'm using Twilight Control. Oh. Yummy. And uh, Lynn will open up her demi plane and says uh, to the rest of the party. Well, actually, does it go through here? Just. Uh, bo 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 bo, it's safe, right? Yeah. I'll let you mean that you're bringing everyone with you. Yeah, she's gonna be attempting to, uh, like, allow everybody through so that the explosion from whatever <laughs> the fuck's happening doesn't. Alright, photo opens up. 
A gateway. Cool. Uh, uh, where are you placing it? Um, she'll place it like right in the center of the party. Alright. Boom, boom, boom. There you go. And yeah. she and Bluey will <laughs> disappear. And... Oh. Alright. I'll just move you off to the side. Yep, yep. And before she uh, heads inside, she'll tell the rest of the party. Before this thing blows, uh, how about we all just get ourselves in a little safer spot? And she, that's when she'll disappear. And my turn's up. Okay. Oh, it won't hurt to do Arcana anyways. I'm not getting shit. What would you like uh, to know? Let's see what I can know with this. Eighteen move a tactic. So we know it's gonna blow up, and I can't exactly ask if I it blasting it is gonna make it blow up even faster. So Well, I mean you can. I can? Yes. Uh, Will blasting it more I potentially cause it to blow up? Well, it can somewhat help because basically the effect that's going to be doing once its turn is uh, there is that it will be choosing to uh, blow itself up uh, within a 300 feet radius. All creatures must make a dexterity save throw or take half the amount uh, on a successful save of this creature's HP plus uh, temporary hit points. Yeah, I can live that. Uh, at the moment, it is this much in total. Can you live that? Yeah. It's called a death sure. ward. Oh, right. Fuck, you have like four <laughs> death wards. I keep on forgetting. Yes. Either way, so uh, I guess... Half that, uh, half that on a successful save. And then is half that of it? that, yes. Uh, this is true force. Is it on the ground, by the way? Ah, true. Yes. Ah, shit. Oh, shit, that might oh, blow up so... my spine. Whoops. Okay, Dreadhound's on the ground, so, unga boonga, me cast, uh... Well, not cast, but, like, me have Conjuring Pain up. I'm not gonna put down the square because I think it's big enough that it doesn't fucking matter. And then, unga boonga, me, Eldritch Blast. Uh, I think all that hits, right? Uh, yes. Cool. So, I'm gonna uh, just do the math real quick with three repelling blasts and one grasp of Hadar, meaning that should be 46 plus 88 plus uh, 4d10. Boop, 65, so 65 plus 13 plus 14. Plus 22, plus 18. Oh, fuck. Mm -hmm. Alright, should be that before Skillo jump hops in, pull, giving a middle finger and joining wherever the fuck Lin is right now. Um, Skillo number one will also do the same. Uh, Hunga Bunga. Eldritch Blast. Minus two on each of those, so I think three hit. Mm -hmm. So, 3d6 plus 3d10 on the Eldritch Blast stuff again, uh, on the Grass of the Darn Conjuring Pain stuff again. So that. Plus however much is from those hits. 19, 19, 13, 14, 79, middle finger, boop. <laughs> Vine Blight, uh, I guess he just accepts his fate. <laughs> uh, and... The Vine Blight will look at you betrayed, dead man, as the Eldritch Blasts <laughs> go off, <laughs> firing one by what one. What can you do? <clears throat> do I see the Mother of All up there? Uh, the cage just being... Do I not see her? Or anything up there? It popped out of existence. 
Neat <clears throat> looks down at the Dreadhound Sea. I'm too far for the portal. Time to do something funny. A mile. Since the mother of all That's is not way. there. Yeah. Oh. Uh, dead man will take out the luck blade. Uh, oh. Stab himself with a chest with it, and then cast Wish. Okay. One time uh, Wish. Uh, I have three Wishes, but this is the first one. Oh. And the blade. Mm -hmm. Uh. And I wish... I wish to have the ability to eat anything and anyone, and trap it within my stomach until the end of time, in a perpetual stasis. Bam. Well, that there. I want to I, be living I, prison. Roll the one B one hundred. I'm so goaded. Well. <laughs> All right. Ba -ba -ba. As you wish upon that, you'll suddenly see that your skin will become somewhat translucent and more somewhat glowed with white light. Oh. As you can feel, I... you can. And then, uh, Deadman will open out his arms and legs and just become a giant maw to eat the explosion. You also have free strength. <laughs> eh. Four days. Minor detail. People. It's fine. Yeah. I'm Eelbot. Yes. Yummy. <laughs> yeah, and I'm Eatbot now. Alright. And also, I'll yeah. fly down in front of people here. And try to spread myself out to eat the explosion just so they don't get hit by it. Right? And suddenly what you see is as your wish goes off and you feel of course that suddenly the explosion will go off upon the creature's turn. Ba ba ba. Alright. Uh, it will explode. Yeah. Oh, and just in case anything fucky happens healing water and waffles they have Oh, uh, death word. Uh, I, I'm not letting I Waffle ask. <laughs> Yeah, I was gonna ask you to do that. Just in case. But they have a death word. Hey, baby. Okay. Uh, dead man, please make me a dexterity same throw at disadvantage because you are uh, taking the blow. Ooh, 13. That's <laughs> <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> oh. <laughs> That's fine. That's fine. Death words. Wow. So many death right. words. As you suddenly see as the blast goes off. Uh, oh, wait, real quick. Basically. Mm -hmm. It would... It, it, they could be at flat roll because Titan's Flames give me advantage on my first roll. Wow. Uh, so, it would be 13. Alright. Oh, wait. No, you wouldn't have the Titan's Flame anymore. Oh, I wouldn't? No, you consumed it. Ah, oh, shit. Right. Daisy Daisy. You've taken it, it into it yourself. You, you consumed it. Monkey's paw. <laughs> Tee hee. Uh, -oh. uh all right. <clears throat> okay, so that's uh, As suddenly, of course, as uh, you see, as the blast sort of goes off, as it somewhat hits you and begins to become somewhat fried, as your attempt at somewhat blocking it somewhat is not necessarily too good, as. Uh, dead man, you take, uh, do 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 do, uh, times two. 1,468 damage. Congratulations. Uh, you have, you have activated one death ward. Dean and Toto and Bells, please make me a dexterity saving bro. Uh, advantage. You got it, boss. Oh, they are, you also are in my aura. Oh, that's a net my 20 order. anyway. Oh, that's oh awesome. my that's fucking god. Holy that's shit, You forget that I'm a dexterous boy. <laughs> Monkey flip. <laughs> Monkey flip. <laughs> no! Toto! 28 for Toto. Holy. DC 30, isn't it? It's a DC 30. I, I can use my uh, full die for this. 
that I need to. Oh. Yep. I, I Please do that and roll uh, two. Is Pally ordering? Uh, roll one. If Pally order is included. I went to let one. you all know Void is <laughs> already at three net 20s this session. <laughs> yep, yep, sounds so what was that about you rolling that ones again, Void? I mean, I guess I was saving up the session. All right, uh, yeah, Toto. Yeah. All right. <clears throat> Despite making the save, of course, you still take half. Uh, Marion has evasion. Uh, so does Bells. Uh, so Toto, you take. Yeah. Take 367 damage. Uh, Oof. holy shit. It doesn't outright kill you. You're under by 37 hit points as uh, you go down. Can I use my reaction to... No, wait. Wait, no. The... You're, you're a barbarian. <laughs> Make me a DC 15 con save. <laughs> DC 15 con save? Sure. Yes. Yeah. My man's too angry to die. All right. Yeah, actually, actually, Toto, if you uh, reaction heal from my uh, Pally Aura, you get a death ward for free. He already has a death ward gonna... that he just has. <laughs> well, I'm just saying. Oh, well. All right, one second. How many hit points are you currently at, Toto? Uh, okay. Uh, all right. <clears throat> As suddenly... As dead man, like pieces of you is pierced through as the blast sort of hit towards the others as well. They managed to somewhat do it as Dean and of course uh, Bells as they managed to basically hide behind you from the blast. However, the full brunt of the force was suddenly hit against Toto as the entire rupture. However, he is literally too angry to die <laughs> as he stands there with his skin flayed. <laughs> He's just standing there. No, no, no. And this, is the this is the moment with, with White Beard on One Piece where he just don't <laughs> want to fucking go down. He asks, <laughs> as the smoke clears, I say, I think you forgot who the fuck I am. I am total motherfucking Azul. Okay. As he fucking rises. Well, I think I guess... you forgot who the fuck I am is such a line. Holy yeah, don't worry. We got a uh, Vine Blight's dead. Bye. <laughs> plus 10 aura, Bye. by the way. Plus set, yeah, oh, yeah, that's so... a plus 10 aura. I was also mainly yeah. stopping it so that the explosion <laughs> would not go in the demi plane. Nah, that's fine. Lynn can just say no. <laughs> real. But what if she said yes and killed Soa? <laughs> she could, she could. Damn. <laughs> Alright, and suddenly you'll see that the pieces of the right hound basically collapse and fall as the entire explosion is completely wiped it away. Uh, from where to purple roses. Congratulations, you did it! And as uh, you also do it, uh, Lynn, from the inside of your own demiplane, including, of course, Dead Man and that, you suddenly see as cracks begin to form, as the abyss itself begins to crumble, as all of you begin to fall. Oh. I swear if your next line oh, is, shit. you wake up on a ship floating in the sky, <laughs> I'm gonna be so mad. Uh, I'd be wondering how the fuck I got there. I, as all eat, of the the... I eat the ending. <laughs> wow, <Whoa>, copium. <laughs> as a... Uh... As basically all of you begin to basically fall, you can all feel that your titan's flames begin to dwindle and disappear. As all of you gain, these don't no. fall, these don't... <clears throat> okay! <Whoa. laughs> oh my god! Oh, <laughs> what the fuck does this mean? <laughs> uh, that on top of that, okay. Uh, all of you gain four exhaustion as uh, you're all fallen. We're uh, dying? Uh, <laughs> as I'm falling, do, am I regenerating? <laughs> I still have regenerate on. Wow. <laughs> yes. Okay, then I'm... Uh, bam. One Back second. to full. Ugh. Uh, right. I'm s until we hit something, I'm spamming healing word on everyone. Well, yeah, you're all falling into the deep dark as you all basically land in a familiar place. I swear to God, it better not be that fucking boat.
Nah. As where uh, all of you end up falling, of course. Uh, as the darkness sort of encompasses you all. Uh, you basically see as uh, as all of you flood into grassland. Uh, one second. Holy shit, why is everyone so okay, big? Grass. Hang on. Cool, are we back in the Feywild? I mean that's a question uh, that you know. Oh like, we just God. stay big, brother. It's, it's the same as fucking goblins, where, like, everyone's size became, like, equal to each other, so I thought you all looked normal size until I put you down onto a normal plate. <laughs> and I'm like, Jesus <laughs> Christ, you look so out of place. Also, I'm just gonna remove everyone's fucking auras now. Get the fuck out of here. Mao, I'm no longer hey. a paladin. I stripped hey, myself. Oh, toad. Hey, I ate my class features. Joey. Uh, Technically, aren't you? You're just a big shit. ass mouth now, aren't you? <laughs> yes. As uh, all of you begin to fall, of course, when you land in this weird sort of grass like land, uh, you then appear here. <laughs> Strictly. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa! I'm still loading in right now. Yeah. No, he's still. Yeah. I'm going I think to he's scream. still. He can be that, but he's just <laughs> not a maw. Ah, uh, man just likes to eat. I wanted to fucking eat the mother of all and trap her in my stomach. Yeah. So did she just poof disappear? Uh, you mother injected all, her with a needle, her so she got super weakened. Yeah. So VV just took her. That oh. bitch! That fucking bitch! I was gonna... Mm. No, I'm going to talk to... I'm talking to Vera. <laughs> I'm getting that fucking baby. I know what she's been doing with the mother of us. I'm getting that fucking baby from her. Baby? Yeah, because she gave me baby mode. Oh. Uh, uh, by the way, everyone gets full healed. I know Sick. it won't matter, but... Uh, I have the fucking... cantrip. I will use it. My tree! That we just put the uh, tree. That was not what I meant to do. I meant to press heal. Where is Dean? Wait, why is there a free exhaustion? There's no afford exhaustion. I don't know what I was at. Oh, there we go. Yeah. I'm currently waiting at 50 out of 51. Yes, as okay. basically as all of you uh, somewhat land here, all of you see, of course, that you are heavily exhausted. Your max HP is literally half from how exhausted you are. Uh, as all of you feel like a piece of you has just been, like, torn out. Uh, do I feel like I still have my, like, connection that I had with uh, being an Ascended one? Oh, yes, you still have that. It's just that your okay. Titan stuff is gone. It yes. burnt out. Can I eat the exhaustion? <laughs> <laughs> He's testing it, it final out. Final transformation. I'm testing out. I, Omar or gave me a wish. I'm using the wish. Can you oh. wish us to have the Titan? <laughs> I can't tomorrow. Oh, the little Among Us. The Among Us. I'm still loading, so uh, give me a moment. Uh, Lynn, like, immediately starts looking around. I'm looking uh, for the tree. I'm looking for the tree. Does see, seem off or different from what we remember? Or, like, as in, uh, do things seem like they were when we left it? <clears throat> or before it, or we last it's left It's nothing like that. It's literally as soon as you arrive, you find the gods as they look at you and finally just go... Oh my god, you're back! It's been so long. <laughs> as you uh as you look up towards the tree, you see this in spoiler channel. You basically find that the tree is burnt at this point, decayed and uh simply it seems to be in flames as a... Uh, well Wait How long <laughs> have we been yeah, out? 
Okay. You've been gone for about two weeks. Although, gesturing from that points up a bit. At least the snow's gone. You're worried about okay. the snow? <laughs> but no Could shit, it's turning, the, it's yeah. turning the fane to, uh... Well, anything that counted oh, as the fane right, to right, these right. weird sort of black icons. We were, um... We minimized it, though, and everything went back to normal once that went up in flame about a day ago. Right. I want my fucking money. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, like, stumbling in into the fucking thing. <laughs> to Toto is at the using... Of all this. Yeah, Toto is using Deadman's Lament as a fucking key. Uh, a walking stick as uh, he's good following dead man. I need a, <coughs> a drink. <laughs> dead man is Come a blob on. just cycling no. through the fucking floor right now. Yeah. Come on, Wobbles. <laughs> Dark lag. Oh, oh uncle! My... <laughs> she like walks up here and takes a seat. <laughs> oh, son of a. I forgot about him. <laughs> Fuck Aris. <laughs> my fucking money. What the rest of you doing? Lynn <laughs> just like looks back to the tree and is just staring at it for a while <laughs> and looks back to the guards and is like, and nothing bad has come from that? Well, the Archmage uh, came to investigate after it went up a light, you know, pretty out of place, but uh, he said that it was because mm -hmm. the abyss is closed now. It's completely gone. The burning of this just shows that the abyss itself has fallen. We just burnt what? the bridge, you guys. It's the flames of a titan. Oh, never mind. <laughs> oh, like, God. Person of a dead man purses all his <laughs> lips at that mention. Oh, she, like, she kind of, like, creases like her brow she seems kind of like perplexed and just continues with but wasn't the tree something of import to the feywild yeah not really wait why <laughs> well, wait. tree tree appeared here about 20 years ago large purple tree and well when it started raining ash the green queen called upon the guild you guys, gestures. She's been wanting to get rid of it for years. We're just gonna turn it into like an IKEA or something now. Uh, what's an what's an IKEA? <laughs> I name. want a fucking statue of each of us. <laughs> uh, that would be a Valkaris thing. Who the fuck? Are, oh wait, you Vak wait. Who the hell are you? <laughs> fucking... That's dead men. <laughs> That's dead man. Holy oh. shit, you all look awful. Uh, yeah, I... Uh-huh, mm -hmm. yeah. Pretty sure the yeah. last time I was here, I was still a fucking gnome. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, this is... This is... This is the fucking you. you. This is Dean. That's yeah, Dean, that's Dean. I, I, uh, I look at the good one, don't I, huh? Well, get How on doing, in. Kitty? <laughs> yeah, and then Lin was an ascended one before too. <laughs> yes. no. I don't know why some of I don't know why Lin has become like a fucking see-through translucent person. <laughs> oh gosh, if you don't fucking answer uh, me. Well, so as you walk in, you basically self see Volcaris with his legs up as he's talking to one of the guards. <laughs> they sort of like both turn to you going, Oh, you're bad. Let me guess, you're the reason that is happening, Gishas to the tree. We, we burnt the fucking tree, yes. Well, Good congratulations. Tree. You've done your job, then. I either want payment or statues. You may choose. <laughs> oh, we can go with... Oh, we can definitely go with the statues. How much were you going to pay us? Well, I mean, it doesn't matter now. We can make statues of you. We'll be sure. I'm going to start eating right him. I'm going to start eating him. I'm going to start <laughs> eating. <laughs> I, I'm going to like fucking flashbang scare him with an infinite Good maw man. that leads to nothingness. Good man, I can use Mason's tools to <coughs> make us a. Have you heard of the great statues. hero Himmel? 
<laughs> I wish there were our statues to be fucking everywhere. everywhere. I rolled a 13 intimidation, please. I'm a live pal of the Let me have 13 once to skip my money. I, I have one could GP. I, could, I could, my big, could, I, I, could my big Hold on. Can I? Could my big as Could my big as body also be there, like, looming at them? No, yeah. I'm gonna just keep- I'm gonna just keep imagining that that sentence Fuck ended at big ass. Fine, we can get yeah, the statues and ass. the pavement. Thank yeah, you. Uh, who says well, saying I'll take both never works? <laughs> we'll put your statues out in the training yard over there. It's a gesture up the window. Over here. <laughs> we better not be the fucking dummies, I, I swear to god. No, I, I, I want it in the- at least where the tree was once it's done burning. Ah, there. Sure, I'll see if I can get that to work. As for your payment, you're reached on down into his uh into his desk as he takes out what seems to be a letter. As he'll just slide it along and just go, take this to a bank or a guild or whatever in the mortal plane, and you'll get your payment. Dead man, a slimy little tentacle reaches for it like. A Venom symbiote pulls it back and then opens it up to read it. Whoa! It's a check! Is How it much? Check? Is it blank? Question. Is it a blank check? 120 platinum. Holy 100. shit. Pretty much. Oh. How much is that? A lot. NGP? <laughs> yeah. But is that per? That's it. I'll, just, I'll just ping fire. Per people? For people, 120 platinum. Shan. 120 oh, wait, not platinum. Each? Not platinum, Electrum. Oh. oh. 120 Electrum each? Yo, I could I could pay someone sure. to reincarnate me every time until I go uh, back yeah, to being I a true gnome. 120 Electrum for the party. Yeah, Electrum's party. above platinum in the setting. Yes. Uh, just for context, Thank you. a thousand gold is one platinum, a thousand platinum is one Electrum. Bro just said I can finally pay child support, that's is crazy. That, <laughs> is that 1.2 million GP then? Yes. Dead man fucking faints. <laughs> <laughs> Bro goes yeah. to be in the party that like kills the mother of all then dies to falling on the floor <laughs> from seeing the cash he got. <laughs> That's a sign of a true baller. Andrew Tate yeah. approved. I'm not poor. <laughs> I'm not poor. Just Just know, you ever been poor? This Just isn't taxed, right? Just know Definitely. that that funding will, of course, be split among all of you, but you can choose who to split it for. Wait, what? I thought it was each. No, no it's... Uh, no. Dead man, wake bullshit, up! Bro. Wake up! Uh, I got reincarnated. I'm awake. I'm awake. God, That's 200,000... 200, 240... 240,000 each. Uh, I think you're missing a couple zeros. <laughs> Aren't you? No. No. Wait, 120... You're just hmm? You're just you're list des you're list two million. million. Shut up, call it again. Each. Hmm? Yeah, isn't there a thousand each for each? Liz Dex, you. Listen, it's an epilogue money. We don't fucking care. It doesn't matter. Don't write hey, it I want to know how big the house on the beach I'm going to get is, all right? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, a I couple a zeros can really make a difference here. I have houses. Either I get a shack or I get my own fucking beach. There's a difference. I I have a house in the Edgelarium, so that's what I need to do. Yes, if you split it all, it leads to 240,000. People. Crying about being poor, by the way, has a house in the Edgelarium. <laughs> Oopsie daisy. He's a right. Nepo baby who ran away from his family. Why does Waffles have that? <laughs> Why does Waffles have that? Whee! I did it! Woo! Gets weak, tones up. Uh, who got it, sweetie? <laughs> no, no, do you know about personal space? Please don't stand so close to me. <laughs> Can't really see f very good right now. I'm seeing blanks. Ugh. All right, you're blind. Anyway. <laughs> <laughs> Only really Did good. Oh, yeah, you're blind, L. 
<laughs> Jay, I wonder when when that was a thing. <laughs> yeah, imagine having a wish and not using it so your friend can see again. Oh my god. <laughs> Is this Mr. Beast or something? Uh, Deadman <laughs> walks over to Dean and I just eat you. You're just dead. Um... <laughs> Imagine not wishing him back to being his true self as a true gnome. That's Shut crazy. the fuck up, you sister killer. <laughs> Imagine not wishing for your friend to sister back. <laughs> um, can't believe you didn't wish. I wish all our problems were solved. <laughs> no, I yeah, no, Honestly. That, that could have saved the world okay. and so much more. <laughs> you wish tax, the wish you for tax evasion. <laughs> I wish to become the DM. Okay, fuck it. I'm rolling one last crit in this game. <laughs> what? Why no? The <laughs> sins are <of hell. laughs> oh. <laughs> You actually did. What the fuck? Wait, what the fuck? <laughs> 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 I'm so I almost double crit. I almost double oh, crit. I, I almost know. double crit. I almost double crit. Holy oh, shit. Oh, you baby rage. Oh my god. You know what, Lord? I do one last thing. I throw that was the your dagger. Last thing. I know. I throw the dagger at Rook, whoever the fuck he is. <laughs> is this some random old man named Rook? <laughs> it's like not even... <laughs> it just hits the fucking star spawn. Season two is us fighting Dorella. Uh, hey, um, honestly, reasonable. <laughs> and the what, gang comes what, back what again. You, like there's some old man rocketing on the, on on a chair, just squints on the horizon, he's rotting he's under a bridge <laughs> somewhere, and he's just one second. <laughs> just gets uh, stabbed. All right, as you throw your dagger into the air, of course it will disappear, and it won't come back for a while <laughs> again. <laughs> Wait, weeks. question, question, God question. Damn it. Was my ban lifted from Amazon for <laughs> saving the world? <laughs> no. Do you, no. Do you, do you are you really the Dean at this time you're calling them? That's really. He's planning no, on turning it into a holiday. Okay. Hey, I... no, that's, I was about to say, hey guys, okay, hear me out. We probably won't be seeing each other a lot anymore since you know whatever but we should meet up every day on what two days ago when i killed that amazon guy we should you know just to uh, get I'm together not... a yearly thing you know <laughs> we could just have, uh, we have uh, marion <laughs> if we i have, have to watch you back. kill someone once a year i might have to kill you By the way, you don't have like to watch should... you could be uh, in the other room it's cool the door will uh <laughs> dean please maybe a deck save as the door slams open up full force Oh. Slight work. Rook's back, baby. All right. Rook, Rook, Rook the comes in with a fucking dagger in his head. Who the as fuck suddenly is as this? You, uh, as you, uh, you hear, of course, loud footsteps from behind the door as you manage to basically oh. dodge the uh, the door slamming open, Marion. As you see this uh, person, like, run in uh, sort of out of breath. Who the fuck? Oh, hello, Lucius. Lucifer Bane Lucius. Hello, yeah. Lucius. Lucius. You need to get the fuck out. What? Huh? What? What, ha what happened? They are coming for you. Run. Who, who are you talking to? Are you talking about Bamazon coming for us? Or like... <laughs> Did we uh, actually like, hit Rook? Uh, Void, I'm going to move over to the side and look out the door but past Lucius. Oh, so <laughs> they're back. Uh, oh. You see, as Everybody... you look past and look behind Lucius, uh, you notice that in Lucius's back is a large sword that has pierced him, uh, specifically from uh, polarity, mm -hmm. as they basically stand in there, attempting to try and get through, but they're hidden against this wall of force. As he simply looks towards you and says, Get the fuck out. Now. Yep, understood. Yep. Going goodbye. Um, <laughs> bells. Well, okay. Oh, hey, God. sidebar. Do you think we can take them now, or is that just a no go? Honestly, I, I was I thinking have, that too. I ha I can't lift my fucking arms, Dean. You Wait, shut the oh, fuck up. Oh, hold on. Oh, yeah, exhaustion. <laughs> right, 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 right. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah. Let's go. Fucking hold. let's let's oh, leave. Lynn looks past Dead Man and looks to uh, Bells and says, 
You better be coming with. You are a part of us. They're going to go after you, too. Right, Uncle, come along. <laughs> As, uh, she'll, like, gesture and he'll, like, bow. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Temporal shoot. Ah. Lucius is gonna be like, who the fuck is that guy with two heads jumping into there? <laughs> uh, he'll just look on and say, Well, congrats on doing everything, guys. <laughs> I'm proud of you. Thanks, Dad. <laughs> Do you, know him? you better not fucking die. Ah. Yeah. Well, I'm not gonna this. <laughs> I want to eat as the a, sword in his <clears throat> stomach. <laughs> as, a, as basically you enter through, you see that Lucius takes out a really suspicious black dagger. Uh, and he stabs himself of it. And as Lynn basically closes the uh, the demiplane, all you hear is, Darken Sun! Oh, oh <laughs> shit. Oh, oh shit. <laughs> he, oh, he did it. Oh, the wow. man did it. He, he got stabbed on purpose. He who. <laughs> <laughs> uh, that dagger out of character, uh, its effect is when it stabs, it, it can willingly take you to one HP. Oh, fuck. Uh, <laughs> Wait. Oh, fuck I'm a, you. Okay. Oh, they I'm fucked. Just, uh, I'm gonna just click this button. Is this how it's that damage? <laughs> yeah. There we go. Uh, wait, uh, hang on. Oh. I, ha I have one request as Valkaris die. Mm -hmm. Uh, no. He doesn't target for car. <laughs> he should. Uh, yeah. Also, there we go. I actually said it properly. But there we go. Nice. Oh, that was not just fly damage. <laughs> I wanted to see my tree. I wanted to see my fucking soul tree. Man, I really hope right. we're able to go back to Wayside. I left my moth there. Oh, oh god. Is, is hey, that no? a fuck? I, can't. I, I have a kid. I have a kid. He has the key. He has the key. Yeah, I was just checking. I was like... I, I don't remember if the wayside is e abyss exclusive. The, so, yeah, it's, wait, in the wait, wait, wait. it's in the twilight. As you well, okay. for, uh, might... <clears throat> basically, as you look down to look for the key, it is no longer there, for you no longer need it. No. Oh, oh, please. Oh, my fucking you. kid! My mother! <laughs> my son! Wait, no. I need, I need a dead you no longer need it. Wait, he there... still need it. Oh, wait, yeah, no, that was one of the rules of the wayside. Yes. Right, Fuck. you can't get it with anymore when you don't need it. Yeah. But the, I need it! I need my son! My fucking mom! <laughs> no, my son. Dude, how the fuck oh, we need a children? Oh yeah, my god! Is... They'll arrive at you in like a day. <laughs> <laughs> the wayside will just throw them out. Wait, wait. No, hold on. Isn't like <laughs> Deadman Simulacrum, simul dead simulacrum there? Yeah, he'll get frozen out. Yeah. Dead, dead. But yes, as basically as all of you enter into the Debbie plane and are uh, able to escape back to the mortal realm, as Link can literally just cast plane shift inside her Demi plane. Uh, that is true. Yes. Uh, all of you then, of course, <laughs> return to the land. Well, the mainland, specifically. As you manage to cash out the bank, the bank person will, uh, will of course, uh, basically almost drop dead at the side of, uh, uh, one point two million gold. <laughs> <laughs> but, uh, as all of you manage to get your cash out, and, uh, you can live happily. Whoa. I, Knowing I have that a both fuckers I... are after us? <laughs> Why are they after I have, us? I have a question, boys. Does it ruin as... the experiment? Yeah. Uh... I have a question for you, Void. Uh, if I look at myself, do I still have my Aberrant Dragon Mark? Oh, yes. Okay, so I do have time. Okay, I was, God, thank I you. was gonna give everyone's epilogues, so, uh... <clears throat> yeah. So, uh, we can start from the top in the VC, about as we start with Oak. Why am I... God. Oh wow! <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so for you, you want to live on a fucking private island? <laughs> no, I mean whatever. I, that was a joke mainly. <laughs> I don't really know what I want to do. <laughs> uh, I can do an epilogue thing for you then, if you don't know. As uh, basically, Dean, as you continue on, uh, of course, after the Abyss Group, 
where you manage to get your fundings, you get your own private stuff now, you can have your own land if you so choose. However, there's always something that seems to be calling in the back of your mind. <laughs> As basically what you find, of course, is this weird sort of feeling. A feeling to return home. One back to, of course, Bamazon. <clears throat> After what seems to be a sort of months or even a few years, you manage to eventually find a way back thanks to the help of Planar magic allowing you to traverse over to it, where you are finally returned to, of course, a familiar place. You don't necessarily remember it exactly, but it's a familiar feeling in your mind. Uh, as you then, of course, find the somewhat the quote-unquote owner of Bamazon, the one who basically resides and controls the gnomes to do the factory work, at first, of course, you feel a sense of anger overcome you as you basically argue with them, fighting over it, as eventually he'll reveal to you your history. Judgment. Well, justice. As... I was about to say, I don't know, yes. know my name. Uh, your title was Judgment. For you weren't just a normal worker, you weren't someone who had worked within the family. Instead, what you were is that you were the ones who sort of, well, the best description is kept people within line. You made sure that there was no dissidents or people basically escaping or leaving if they chose not to work anymore. And thus, you were simply known as the title of Justice, the one who gave judgment onto those who were, of course, against the factory. <clears throat> However, when you had grown older and older, your age had basically caught up to you, you began to forget, you began to, of course, make mistakes. And with that, you, of course, made one of the ultimate mistakes, killing your sister. In somewhat of your dementia-like state, your not understanding of anything, you had thought that your sister had become a dissident. Someone who didn't want to be part of the factory no more and was attempting to leave when in actuality they were attempting to somewhat cause a little surprise for you. A surprise birthday. However, <coughs> instead you had plunged a dagger into their chest, thinking that they of course were evil. They were falsehoods from what you had been taught since birth. And that was the last line on your own mental state. As you began to crumble more and more, eventually, they threw you out. They threw you like the others, much your age, as, well, you couldn't find your place in the mortal realm. The owner of the Bamazon, the one who goes by the name of Lakar, <clears throat> he simply offers you a gesture, uh, a kindness, as he simply asks if you would like to continue your post. To be, of course, a, the one who can spread judgment onto, of course, the ones who would cause problems within Bamazon. Or would you like to return back to the normal realm, and he will forget about your breaking? What do you do? You're muted, buddy. Um, I think I would go back to the moral realm. I don't think I would go back to being a slave. Especially <laughs> after I realized that it killed my sister because of it, you know? As, uh, <clears throat> as you choose that towards them, they will simply, uh, they'll give you a simple smile and simply say, Well, you are always welcome here, Justice. You were one of my best, after all, before your mistake. And seeing as you are more in your prime now, you would have made a great part of the team. But 
If you have found a place within the mortal realm, then so be it. I hope that you find your place someday. I'll, uh... I'll think about it. I might... I did find some sort of place, but, uh... In doing that, I did make a few enemies. And... If you're still allowing me to call this place somewhat of a home for me... I would like to ask that if I did need a favor in exchange for my services to you once again, I'll, uh, would you take me up on that? Of course. Whatever to benefit the factory, after all. Okay. Yeah. I'll, uh, I'll be around. Um, I'll uh, keep in touch for sure. But uh, until until then, I'll um think I'm gonna go find me a nice beach house somewhere. Maybe start a family again. It's kind of rough down there, but you know it is what it is. Of course. Well then, take care. And please use the door this time. The windows have already <laughs> been broken many times already. Yeah, I, I will. Uh, he's gonna... I, hold on. I feel like Dean found something throughout his travels that was... I guess that originated... Oh. Ah, yes. Uh, as you uh, as you turn to leave, Lakar will simply reach out his hand and simply go. And speaking of which, may I have the battery back that you had stolen? I was just about to return it. No, like not even gonna lie. I uh, don't think I'm gonna be needing it. Good. And he will gladly give the um the. The battery back. Mm. Um, is there anything I can, I guess, maybe before I go, take with me so that I can contact you again? You just simply case... need to go up to the nearest shadow and say a secret word. <laughs> I'm back from that. <laughs> oh, yeah. Uh, I guess even ask. in my absence, I was still a judicator of sorts. I would like to ask that my account be reinstated. <laughs> it just looks no at you. Fucking <laughs> no fucking shot. Looks at you. <laughs> listen, listen, listen. If that was my job before to keep people in line, mm. you know, I kind of just was working overtime. Well. If you would like to have your account reinstated, it will be as soon as you decide to work with us once again. Okay, Employees actually, get a 3% I... off bonus. <laughs> I don't think I'm going to be worried too much about that, but I do have a question. When you say to take post again as justice and, I guess, judgment... Does that mean I get to hunt down little fuckers that, you know, leave? Is that kind of... Yes, in ones the who would escape the factory. Huh. Let me go get my things. I'm moving back in. <laughs> He'll give a nod and <laughs> simply uh, reach out his hand for a handshake. You little sociopath. Fucking shakes it, dude. Yeah. Jesus Christ, dude. But this he time, I remember. <laughs> he'll, he'll shake your hand and simply say, Welcome back to the family. And you too, as he gestures to the uh, to the slime on your shoulder. <laughs> yes! My son! 
Okay. <laughs> Holy shit. Fuck yeah. <laughs> it's good to be back. <laughs> You're gonna use the fucking right. sun as body <laughs> disposal too? No, he's. I'm gonna train him to be better than me, bro. That's you are now, as you what reinstated the fuck? as, of course, one of the protectors of Amazon. Also known as Babylon. Hell, hell oh. yeah. Wait, also, wait, I stay as a drama heart, right? Yes. Okay, cool. Hell yeah. Did he just get his son hired as a mafia member or Amazon? Both. <laughs> Both. <laughs> no, that's sick. I like that. Thank you for that. <laughs> Wow. Homie invites us once a year to witness his annual performance and then shoots a fucking Amazon worker at the end. <laughs> Capital punishment, baby. Oh wow. my god. Alright. The next, of course, is Lin. Well, Not dead. As, Whoa. <laughs> as for you, Lin, after, of course, uh, saying your goodbyes to everyone and doing your, uh, no more sort of things before you set off to your journey to the Twilight Plane. Finally, of course, meets a sort of innate feeling within you, an ascendant from your ascendants. The core of stars, as they would be called, as what you find is that you are not alone out in the Twilight. As instead, what you find is that there are indeed many somewhat ascendant elves. Not ones that had reached ascendants like you, but Ones that are halfway through their journey. And they simply, as you finally meet this somewhat tapestry of this place full of these people, all of them will simply give a bow towards you, saying that Borum had told you, them about you specifically, and that they ask for you to teach them the ways of ascendance. Wow. And her reply to them would be, I can respect that request. Yes, I shall teach you, though only under one condition. The one that I think all of you would agree to, well, quite easily. My goals here in the Twilight, the ones that I share with Forum, is that I wish to see our people free, our chains broken. So, the only thing I ask of you in return is do as I am now. Teach those you know who haven't even reached the steps you have. Make it so that we're all, well, free. They will agree as they cheer. For, of course, cosmic elves want to be free of that from their bindings. Ones where they were not the ones who ran away from the Twilight, much like other elves. But they still respect the other elves as, well, they follow this mind and this tenant that you have asked of them. As each of them will eventually spread out, more and more elves will somewhat <clears throat> basically congregate at your place. As eventually, your somewhat little place, your little congregation suddenly becomes bigger and bigger and towards the equivalent to that of a city, an empire, one to simply face against the starspawn, with, of course, aid of the actual starspawn themselves, Borum, who aid you from the shadows, continuing not to, well, chooses never to meet you, but you can feel that they're watching Or, what will you name your empire? Oh, shit, man. <laughs> Skibbity Pyre. <laughs> I like to call it the Brain Rot Starlight Crew. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> Whatever you do, it doesn't matter, because Dead Man's going to wish to wish to change the name. One <laughs> of your, your three wishes just to spite me in the end. <laughs> Don't know why my sendings were identified. 
Oh, no. Honestly, oh, no. she kind of would do that in the future. <laughs> yeah. Land, yes, help me. I'm trapped in the stomach of a beast. Why are you ignoring me? Um, hmm. I might actually have to come back to you with that one. Because uh, it probably won't be... Well... I think it'll probably just be a name that she crafts for it herself rather than anything like immediately pertaining to her. Uh... That is fine. Name. Yeah. Um, yeah, at the very least, um, it'll be known, of course, as like a safe hidden beyond the twilight. Uh, sort of. Um, I, I I guess this kind of ends up being similar to that in uh of the cities in Elden Ring, but uh, it would be like a. I can't never mind. I can't think of it. Lindell, <laughs> I can't believe Lindell. It. It's the Golden Order. <laughs> oh please no! Name it Lindell, please. <laughs> oh my God, Lindell! <laughs> I second this. I second this so fucking much. Holy shit! Okay, this is actually so fucking funny. You know what? Um, she's a narcissist paladin. You're a narcissist. Yeah, you're a narcissist paladin. Come on. Uh, it'll be <laughs> Lindell, City Beyond the Stars. Whoa! All right. Lindell, city of the star, beyond the stars. Ah, Bubba. <laughs> Push that down into my feet. Oh, fuck, my notes. Alright, there we go. Alright. As, of course. Uh, you will continue to be somewhat similar to that of a monarch of the Empire. But of course, this Linda. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa, that's so narcissistic. It's in character. All right. Whoa. That's why I was saying Linda. <laughs> yes. Because it'd be as, perfect. As for, of course, then Dead Man. Uh, you fulfill finally a promise made uh, to, of course, your oath yourself. As you can, of course, feel the many souls within you rumble, uh, attempting to finally get out now that they are no longer in their binded state. <clears throat> so, returning back to the Angelarium, you manage to, of course, finally set the souls free within you, so that they may return back to the cycle. Not taken, of course, by the Abyss anymore, used as energy or any of that sort. As they're finally free, including that of your siblings, as you return back to only that of two eyes. You go see your father. I would go see V, yes. But there would also be a couple stops along the way. If possible, the oh. dead man would go to the Akatsuki records. Akatsuki <laughs> records. That is not possible. Get not possible, well, he would search um, away, because I want to fucking bring Braska's story to his clan. Uh, if if anything, he would, if he can't find a way, he would go personally tell the tale to the Killer clan of Braska's as, last moments in his venture into the Abyss. As you basically attempt uh, to spend somewhat a few months after, well, before meeting your father at trying to find, of course, anything that you could about Braska, the god killer. You find, of course, that there is no such thing as the Akatsuki records. The nearest thing that you can find is that of the Arkane University, one where the Archmage himself is capable of reading it. However, when you ask him about it and whether it can be, he tells you that it is a place that does not technically exist. It's just, it is basically the same premise as that of Henry Akut himself. He exists, but not at the same time. And because of that, it's part of the world. The only thing capable of is simply reading it, experiencing it there, and not to 
have your brain explode from the over amount of knowledge of an entire person's life and everyone got disconnected. Uh, <clears throat> you can reconnect him. Uh, however, of course, the Archmage does give you a single book as he basically gives you a somewhat a book of Braska, specifically one of his tale, one of his life. Not like the Akatsuki Records, where it is a book of everything that's happening to him or has happened, but just a simple sort of tale, a story. As when you look down upon it, the author is Braska. Dead Man would thank the Archmage profusely at that and would go to the Killer Clan and deliver it personally. Oh. I think he. I think he would go find his daughter because I meant I believe Braska mentioned his <clears throat> yeah yes. that she was the new uh, leader of the Killer Clan. Yes. She simply nods, takes the book, and uh, gives you a uh, a single like pen as a uh, gift. The pen is basically just it isn't anything special, but just something that uh, Braska used to have back when he was in his. Uh, Arcane University, uh, back when he was studying physics. <laughs> uh, Dan Man would take it graciously and happily and offer them a odd smile because he smiles through his eyes. But he wouldn't say much. He would let the story do the telling and his body language do the rest as he would then leave and head to the Angelarium. Mm-hmm. I I should reach to the Angelarium and such, and finally decide to meet your father. <clears throat> you find that he's um... avoiding it. <laughs> he's avoiding. Whoa. <laughs> the mouth. Uh, I say for the father stuff because it's another player. Uh, that will be a thing for uh that you and Leo can do. Hubba. Oh my fucking god, Joey. That's stupid. This is as fuck. a work of art. Oh my this god. Is stupid as fuck. <laughs> but it worked. Wait, 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 wait. Instead of Lin's face on uh, the dragon, Louise. Hey, look, there's Leo. Louis. <laughs> Whoa. Is this I, canon? It's just pictures of, <laughs> of Lin. Uh, hold on. Give me one sec. If we're doing oh. Groovy's voice, hold on. I gotta get it. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> that was looking great. <laughs> I can't believe like Lid was actually sacrificing the elves uh, in the Empire. Uh, now all of them are like uh, she's a demi lich now. Uh, I can't believe this. <laughs> Railroad. Railroad. Oh, I need to figure out what I'm going to use Dead Man's two wishes on. Actually, I'm just going to roll the D100 to see if I can actually cast another one. I can! I can cast all three. I await uh. Leo to find her toys. Yes. Actually, I do have a question. Uh -huh. While we're waiting, uh, would Lin learn anything about? I'm gonna, I'm blanking because I haven't said the name anymore. But Celia or Seria, I forget which one is uh, the other personality of Louis. But in regards um, to like that, in like in toners. Uh, yes. Uh, oh no, Sarah. no more. <clears throat> Uh, also, okay, I'm I, think just I, a, I think I have the perfect one because I'd like to think oh, yeah. uh, he would reincarnate back into his Warforge form <laughs> during the time during the time he's been reflecting. People, oh, that's right. Oh, hold on, I lost. Daffy. I lost you guys. One sec. Oh, okay. Um, wait, I can answer now, as Leo's still dead. Oh. Uh, 
<clears throat> uh, uh, Seria is specifically uh, all guardians of Intonas. Uh, basically, they have what you find is that they originally had an origin. They were originally people before they became guardians. Uh, Seria is the original personality that was, of course, this original human. Bluey is the construct of your own subconscious that is uh, projecting out instead. It's why there are two. Okay. Yeah. So, so one is someone's me, and then the mm -hmm. other one is like uh, a portion of that first one. Yes. Like the first human. Okay. Is uh, is basically this aspect of uh, whoever these like first people were. Bah. Okay. Speak now, Leo. Well, Among Us. Leo, please. <laughs> Is my voice working? Yes, unfortunately. Okay. <laughs> I'd like to think he reincarnated as a Warforged during his uh, his time. Uh, so, Dead Man's coming to the Angelarium? Yes. To meet Pap Pap. Hmm. Uh, you don't even have to meet him. As soon as you set single foot on the Angelarium soil, you just see, like, <laughs> you know, like, Radon, like, Radon, uh... The phase like, two? The phase two, where he does, like, the dive bomb. Oh, yeah. You just, out of the distance, you hear, My baby boy! <laughs> as he as he fucking oh. dive bomb hugs you. <laughs> oh no, he's back into that fall. Oh fuck, oh fuck, oh fuck, oh fuck. Just sidesteps it. My vanilla eyes. I don't go by that anymore, but I guess you'll call me that regardless. No, I'll call you what you want to be called. I'm so proud of you. It's dead man now. Dead men Absolutely funkadelic. <laughs> well, <laughs> fucking hate. You. I forgot this is why I chose Groovy as my father. That's absolutely fucking Absolutely funkadelic, baby boy. Now tell me, I want to hear all about your journey to the abyss. All right, I will. It'll take a bit of time. I um, these are yours as well. Uh, he will remove his gauntlets and hand them over to you. They, they're yours. They were never mine. Oh, uh, Groovy picks. So as he picks them up, I like. I imagine the second I touch them, it turns back into the katana. Katana, yes. He looks at it. He thinks about it. Uh, reflects on it, and then he turns back to Dead Man. And he holds it out, and he says, You may have taken the blade. You may not have taken the blade or earned the blade when you first ran off with it. But after everything you've been through, this blade, this our family heirloom, you've earned that right. Wield it with pride. Wield it with style. As he uh, hands it back to Dead Man. Dead Man will give a pretty conflicted look, but he'll take it. I I will. Plus, I got another one made of light. As a uh, <laughs> fucking one made of life just appears. Fucking pulls out a lightsaber. Not even like a <laughs> literally. Anti, yeah, like literally. not even an anti copyright lightsaber. It's just a lightsaber. It's the purple <laughs> it's one, isn't it? It's blurred out on stream to for copyright. There's just a, a giant rainbow. mouse there. It's a rainbow yeah. lightsaber. God damn it, Dad. Oh, also, I have any money. I have a fuck ton of money now. I also have a castle here. Yeah, I was about to ask about that. I was doing my yoga, and all of a sudden, this uh, castle appeared out of nowhere. I was like, holy shit. Fucking... <laughs> Bring back Ruby, please. <laughs> I love Ruby. <laughs> He's had his happy ending. Don't let him get away from it. 
I, I can't bring him back to loss a third time. Maybe another campaign. <laughs> Maybe season two. I don't um, know. But uh, all right. Let's let's go have a sit down. Oh, give me a second. Uh, I brought I, I brought Scylla along. This is Scylla. Hello. <laughs> She's kind of homeless. <laughs> all right. As you basically have a sit down and talk, I'll move on to Kaha. <laughs> I feel like they're distracted by something. <laughs> I would, uh... Oh, sh... Mute? <laughs> oh, fuck! <laughs> oh, sorry, guys. So, yes. Uh, Scylla, are you ready? Uh... Oh! Easier to ask for forgiveness. Okay. <laughs> Alright. As, as for you, Scylla, uh, as you two get your money and finally, after a while, split this with everyone, to sort of do your own method... Of course, someone joins you on your escapade. One to finally get your brother back. A fellow beast walker. One who, of course, had asked of, well, to aid you. Fear. As, oh, man. <clears throat> as you basically end up going towards the Ever Forest, you find, of course, that something feels different about yourself. That your pact is gone. Whenever you try to somewhat call upon the patron's power, you realize that it's been stripped of you. And upon oh, reaching no. to the Ever Forest, it's because you find out the truth. The Ever Forest is not allowing anyone at this point to enter, including yourself. Any pact, any person who was that of the lost, fellow people who followed you as well, were stripped of it. As when you finally reach to the other forest, you find out the truth. The entire forest is burning a light. Holy oh, shit. The only things that you can really see through the fog of it is that the castles themselves are seeming to have a somewhat light of red suddenly fire off into the sky and as it rains blood. But no matter how much you try, because of the power that you have gained from your adventure, from this time power that you have, from your levels that you've gained, your experience, you can't enter no matter what. So, a suggestion comes to you. To do what exactly would happen to, of course, your party members, what happened to them. Call upon adventurers, ones who can somewhat bypass this layer. Pause. Uh, yeah. Uncle Carp said, give me a second. Buh. Among Us. Also, I didn't get to mention it, because Father Son time, but Dead Man would go the fuck to Vera and ask her so many shit. Uh, when you come to Vera Vavella, you find that, uh, they're just as confused as you. Oh, I have other questions besides the mother of all <laughs> shit, but I could do, yeah. I could DM you that later. Uh, <laughs> I like to imagine Veer's like, hey, so can you stop bringing back your kids? And Gruby will be like, no. <laughs> back off, bitch. I mean, reincarnation is fine. It's not against the rules. You're no, just it's like just recycling souls. Yeah. Constantly reincarnating. I like to imagine Veer's like, hey, so can I have that power back? No, it's mine now. <laughs> nah, <laughs> that's true. <laughs> uh, no, I know. I have a question. Why is the mother of life evil? Why was she trying to make me evil? Then know what you mean. Shut the fuck up. It's epilogue time. I get to ask these <laughs> questions and you get the answer. I mean, if, if Deadman explained <laughs> like that, if Deadman explained that, then, like, Groovy would slow turn and be turn to his wife and also <laughs> ask that <laughs> like his he wouldn't he'd be standing in place his rollerblades just slowly slow turning to uh face mother of life wow why didn't you have a chaotic evil alignment uh because i became lawful neutral at the end of the campaign fuck you mm -hmm. whoa or lawful good. I think lawful good. I don't know. Hey, honey, what did you ever do with that nuke that we found in our backyard? Wait, do you have a nuke? 
<laughs> Can I eat it? Uh, uh, bam! Oh, God's here, bam! Bam! <laughs> bam! Bam! <laughs> The <laughs> there you go. I will riddle your skin with our bones. <laughs> All right, just go. Wait, can I tune to the book? <clears throat> can I tune to the book of exalted good deeds? No, you don't. Good. <laughs> After I can get all Groovy, this. <laughs> can Groovy attune to it? No. Why not? You've killed. After I put all the souls back, I feel like I should be a net positive <laughs> reverse KD right now. It, d it well, doesn't undo it. It doesn't. It's... I didn't kill most of them. You still killed. <laughs> Sir Lawrence is killed, and he gets tuned to it. Fuck you. Yeah, but Sir Oops. Lawrence is Sir Lawrence is uh, Veer's favorite. Well, guess favorite. what? Guess what? This book I'm gonna have forever because I'm a little horde goblin. Forever paperweight. You know, yeah, it yeah, probably yeah. it probably would have let you attune to it if you didn't stab Sir Lawrence across space and time. Probably. <laughs> That's uh, the unforgivable <clears throat> sin. Not all the murder or the unintentional uh, accidental murder. I'll do a dizzy thing so uh, Kyle wouldn't get back. So, <clears throat> Toto. Mute. You there? Yeah, I'm here. All right. As for you, as of course you split from the rest as well after your payment. <clears throat> You, of course, uh, finally have your friend back, Waffles, who, of course, you now know as, of course, the Mother of the Abyss, uh, sealed away into, of course, a familiar form. <clears throat> but, as you, of course, follow along, you finally meet your family again, Mrs. Poppin, Moppin Poppin, <laughs> and the like, oh. as, you, as, of course, you have, of course... Waffles, who seems to be happy to finally see that they do have their family back. However, of course, there is a goal that you would, have, of course, want to fulfill. To meet the dragon who had marked you, of course, with that of marriage, who have the equivalent to that of marriage you've been trying to call over ever since. As, of course, when you feel the mark and follow it along, eventually you will find it. Along with, of course, your children. Mm. Oh. Oh, yeah. Yes. As you uh... do... <clears throat> as you do meet her, though, she does offer exactly what she had offered you before. She said... She admits that, yes, she does have somewhat still feelings for you, that the night that she spent with you was a time that she remembers fondly. And that is why she, of course, had given you a gift in order to keep you protected from what she could. And, <clears throat> but she understands that, of course, your life is your own. So she offers, of course, to retract, if you so choose, but mark that instead of sharing the same life as her as a dragon, instead, live your own life and be free. Eh. Mm. Uh, huh. Well, Lavina, got me in a pickle here. <laughs> I'm gonna look, look at him. You know, I'm old now. Probably have, I don't know, a decade or less. Ain't gonna be enough. Uh, uh, Ain't gonna be enough for everything I've old oh, thirty years that I've not been with a uh, fuck uh, with any of uh, my kids or their mom or, or you. If I had known this, I I don't know. I I would have tried better. And if still having your mark on me, I would give me time, enough time to at least be 
at least be someone uh, a part of uh, their you your life or anyone's life uh she, she would interject and simply say if you would want to of course stay with me you would have all the time in the world Tedo. yeah uh uh, it totals just like trying to find the words that's coming out of the mouth and not like not like screw this up all, all over again for himself and everyone. So look at him, looking at Levina, at waffles, uh, muffin puffins, and uh, his four children's that she that are still alive at that point it thinks about um he thinks about trying better for every one of them and Lavina's giving him a chance to do so and he will just nod to her without saying a word then if you would like to spend your life with me reach out your hand and he will do so upon doing so it looks nice as you suddenly reach out your hand towards her as she seems to be in a humanoid form at the time but Suddenly what you'll see is that as you reach out and she too, her hand, her hand suddenly turns into a draconic sort of arm as it grasps around your own sort of wrist. As it tightens around, you can feel a somewhat some piercing sensation in your hand. And then a flow of magic. As you suddenly find that your draconic sort of mark, your dragon mark begins to glow and burn and sear into your own flesh as the truth of it is revealed for what a draconic mark can do. As when you look down upon your body, you now find that you have become a dragon. Well, <laughs> he looks at uh, himself. Well, oh shit! <laughs> it can't. It's just shock at what happens. Just oh wow! <laughs> like he just looks at Lavina. Do I have eyes now? Yes. Good question. For the first time, you're finally able to see, and the first person you see, of course, is Lavina as she stands there smiling at you. Like, uh, he will then, with his now draconic, like, fa uh, uh, head slowly just touches, uh, uh, leans his forehead to hers and just softly says, You're just, you are just beautiful as I've dreamed of. <laughs> like, <laughs> just as he looks at his uh, sapphire eyes, what you he bend up do and uh, end up embracing. And of course, that oh. is then the story of Toto, who first started out, of course, as a simple mercenary, one who wanted to enter that into that of mists. However, due to wild magic, and affecting your body and somewhat causing you to need to return home to somewhat recuperate. You managed to avoid a doom that, of course, would put you into that of the twilight. But in turn, you finally found your family. After the many years of missing, you eventually rescue them. As, of course. And in the end, you finally found a loved one. A family, happiness, and of course, life insurance due to the god of grief. But, yes. <clears throat> as now, you of course are simply known as, well, 
Your draconic name. Oh. Uh -huh. Yes. Let me go get your draconic name. <laughs> Well, Azul. <laughs> Cursed Azul. Yes. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> As that's happening to like, do he still has Dead Man's Lament uh, on his possession? Yes. Question one. Please change the name of it in your days of. Age. I would. I yeah. What's gonna happen is that through, it's gonna be a reminder of the journey. That he has gone through, and all the friend, the all that has happened to him. So, yeah, he's gonna he's gonna call it by two names. One for his enemies, it's called yeah. <laughs> I was gonna say abyssal lament, and the other would be gr grand tail, because. <laughs> A nudge to dead men too. As oh. Dead men. Yeah. That's mm -hmm. the two name. That's the two names he will give uh, the new uh, anchor now. Oh, he's so cool. <laughs> Alright. Go. And yes, okay. as for your draconic name, it is known as Azula. <clears throat> Azula. Yes. Okay. Azula, Lord of the Sea. Lord of the Sea. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> should I? Uh, should I be right a bit? Uh, shit. <laughs> Yes, mm -hmm. the freaky dragon. Freaky dragon. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> and Karth, you're back, so uh, as for you... Yes, I have returned. Yes. After you, of course, had heard the suggestion of, much like doing what was done with your party, basically calling upon some new ground adventurers, ones that are weak enough to actually go through the barrier that is set to stop strong enemies and strong foes from doing it, and making somewhat of a pact towards them with your own time-like power that was gifted to you. Quick question about those time powers. Um, the red string guy wanted the pound of, like, Dreadhound flesh, and um, oh, obviously I that. haven't procured that. He got that. Uh, what the fuck? Don't worry. Okay, shit. The same as Bells managed to consume some of the flesh. I oh. gotta find Bells and marry her. <laughs> so yes, uh, you are basically Carpsiller is the patron slash uh, quest giver for the next campaign. Hell yeah! But into the, a burning uh, forest. The ever forest campaign. Yes. <clears throat> basically, Hell the premise yeah. of that is that everyone starts off as a first level warlock with any subclass and it's because of your time power that you're able to basically access any uh, patron's domain okay <laughs> sick so an entire party is technically patron to you but they get their own subclass okay okay oh i'm gonna get pinged okay <laughs> Santa, we gotta be like walking through this really cool ocean. Should we do that? <laughs> Time stop. I start digging a fucking moat around that. <laughs> Yo, Scylla, like, is it okay to piss on this tree that's speaking as, dark speaks into my ear? As for Bells, do it. Uh, she and her uncle, of course, will say goodbye for now to all of you. She must, of course, return back to her empire. Her pact with the, of course, one of the Abyssal Lords is now gone. So she is feeling a lot more fuller <laughs> than she was originally. As where, of course, she enters back and, of course, returns to, well, <clears throat> returns back to a throne. But. As a... Uh,
as she finally returns back as queen. Because, uh, guess what? She lied. She was actually the queen. She wasn't a princess. I still try to marry her. <laughs> I will send her love letters every fucking day. Yes. My man's trying um, to become the royal consort. Okay. Yeah, so for the known as Benadrops. It's an alliance well, between two kingdoms. It could work out really well. As, uh... As she basically reestablishes a bit of a uh, empire and such, as Belladrax, <laughs> the Queen of Flies, uh, continues on. Of course, Dead Man will send her letters, and she would reply happily until eventually, after what seems to be about a year or two of consort, eventually she will agree to marry you. I'm happy. <laughs> I'm happy. <laughs> Whoa. You know Groovy's gonna be breathing down your neck asking when he's when you're gonna bring some grandkids. <laughs> uh, he just he does, this, does this face whenever you ask. He's gonna be He's gonna be like anytime you two are alone, he's gonna like poke his head in and play careless whispers with his <laughs> minor illusion. <clears throat> he wants some grandbabies. Yes. As, of course, you become that of basically the king, uh, mm. also known, of course, as the Lord of Flies. Uh, okay, though, I'm fine with that title. <clears throat> yes. Though, of course, you seem to be much more busy with other things, being a paladin of life. But you, of course, always have a place to come back to. Ah. So, yes. And that is the end of Chapels of the Abyss. Being able to, yeah, of course... Pains. The what? <laughs> no <laughs> fucking <laughs> shot. <laughs> the what? <laughs> no fucking shot. No fucking shot, you ruined it. No On the last <laughs> episode. We have to Has he ever made this mistake before? Uh, we have to do the whole oh, campaign. Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> Not like... <laughs> somebody, somebody clip that. <laughs> <laughs> There's no we way. The no way. We have to redo the whole campaign. I, I guess oh, we're no. making up for the season two. Oh, oh, right. My oh, brother no. we did, we <laughs> did it and the time loop. Oh no. Oh. I, did not, I, did, I did not just spend the last two years to get my title dropped wrong at the last fucking moment. <laughs> <laughs> and, thus, and thus ends the Chains of the Abyss. Where. Yeah. I'm gonna fuck sure? all with the set the chains of the abyss embedded in my hand. After going through uh, ritual hell and being able to defeat the lords, the previous lords of the Fey Queen, you have finally, finally defeated the Dread Hound and sealed away the Mother of All. <clears throat> but I hope you enjoyed the campaign. It was very fun. Hmm. I want a refund. <laughs> Joey, out here for murder. Okay, but now you have to do the same thing with shackles, and you have to yeah. say the last episode of the chains of the Yeah, 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 yeah. I'll be sure to. I'll be sure if I remember. Should have yeah. just called them shackles A and shackles B. <laughs> <laughs> wow. It was because hey. I was going for my fucking notes. <laughs> I avoid so no since shot. Dead Man married. Does that mean like does the Angelarium and that kingdom have like a good alliance or a healthy relationship? I mean, like both marriage? of them are also like war races, so yeah. Yeah, war pact, war pact. <laughs> oh like, no. The, the Angelarium uh does like the killing and the war, and then the bugs just like come and clean up the corpses to like consume. Oh, that's fucking <laughs> rad. We're a self-sustaining cycle. Oh, but yes. Let's, Let's go invade Holy Riss. But that All I'm <laughs> saying is good luck no. trying to fuck with the Bamazon. Yeah. <laughs> uh, I this will also enough. end stream here. So, be happy. Bye, chat. Oh, yes, yeah, guys. Uh, Bye, chat. <laughs>
and of course, for people interested, Lucius Bane Dragon continues to survive because uh, he's the main character of Ferrer, of course. Not as, not as. Uh, <clears throat> he managed to basically fight back them as he weakened them, but uh, he teleported out with the rest of the people there, Lobau. As, uh, well, the Foundation really, really hate that they fucked with the experiments. But yes, and of course, I will end it here. Final <laughs> sneeze. Uh, woo, I'm free. And of course.